everyone, this is Makator. Welcome to The Bones of Ragnvald. This is a mod uh, played for Mountain Blade Warband, and it is actually developed by one of the Parisian developers for the last few years, and it is uh, his side project, I suppose. All right, uh, the main overview for The Bones of Ragnvald, it's actually a story mod, uh, more or less. It has a sandbox mode as well, obviously, but uh, the main meat and bones of this mod is the story. So we'll be taking a look at that today, and avoiding sandbox only mode. So let's jump right into things. We'll do story, continue, and we'll do all this good stuff quickly. Some iron flesh, some power strike. Uh, we'll have to do some athletics as well because gotta have that start of the game. There's a new feature actually as well called lock picking. Uh, we might take a look at that as well. I'm not sure how long this video will be. So leadership and get some pole arms up. Because we just start off with a funky pole arm. Oh man, let's just do big, uh, big boy with long hair. All right, he looks good enough. Whatever. All right, we have landed in Urine. Urine? I'm not sure how to say that. Oh, there he is. Hello, sir. Yep, and we're gonna follow this guy now. I think. Yeah, there you go. He won't let us go anywhere. We can't leave, and we have to talk to Baron Torben, first off and foremost. Looks beautiful, actually. Look at this scene. Ang Angier's Castle. And a militia will lead you to your lord, but you may also explore the area at will. There are chests to lockpick in many places throughout the area, if you choose to explore, including here. There's a maximum of one chest per scene. So we'll, be we'll actually see if we can find that chest here before we talk to Baron Torben. It'll be an interesting siege scene as well. Wow. Hell of a deer, he would wreck me right now. Look at, look at my suit. I've got a straw hat and some rags. Yeah, boy, that's how you start off Bones of Rag involved. I'm going to... We'll look around here a bit, see if I can find a chest, and we'll go talk to Baron Torben when we're ready to talk to Baron Torben. Ooh, what is, look what we have here. Let's see if our lockpicking lock picking skills are adequate. And we don't have this sufficient skill, so, yeah, that's one thing we'll have to, ooh, what's that tower do? We'll have to upgrade our lock picking skill a little bit, and let's go into the castle. And talk to Baron Torben, a bunch of stuff, and I will do as he asks. So now we have to defeat the Herner Scouts, which are around here somewhere. To the All right, this is the map of, it's massive, it's absolutely massive, and there's so much to look at here, it goes forever, yep. So, it's not uncovered. It's very similar to the feature in uh, Parisno where you have to walk around and uncover the parts of the map. So, uh, as you move, more stuff will be uncovered. Disorders, we got some poachers. More poachers spawning in. Jeez. Loaded with poachers. We'll save right here just in case. And can we go to this village without getting attacked? Early on, it's pretty easy, but there's a lot of parties, so we'll have to watch ourselves. And we start off, we have only 15 orums, uh, dinars left. Now, just castaways. What do we have here? Herner Scout. There we are. Herner Scout's pretty easy here. All right. The smell of fear. You're ripe with it. Okay, then. Sounds ominous, and I'm starting out with a nice pitchfork. Got a bunch of recruits and a few militia. All right, boys, hold the line. Let's hold the line. Eat my pitchfork. Right in your face, boy. You stand no chance against my militia. Look at this guy throw rocks. What a beast. Yeah. Just get wrecking these boys. Yeah. Cut him down. Wait, what? There's some left. Oh, there's one left. Now, I'm like, what the heck are you doing? That should do it. 
We'll capture two of these. Upgrade some recruits. We're out of money. Oh boy. Yeah, there we go. We got a boat. We got a boat. Let's get off our straw hat. Uh, arrows better than nothing, I suppose. We got a little money here. All right. Estimir militia. We got some recruits, some spearmen, and now Baron Torben is asked you to kill a group. We have to go back to Baron Torben now. Boy, these castles, these poachers are pretty annoying. They're gonna come get you. All right. Request entry to the castle and go talk to Baron Torben right away. All right, perhaps you're not an orphan after all. After a while, the men I gave you shall stay with you till then. Train them as you wish. I know you will put them to great use should remain in my service. Since you're proving your spirit, would you find <clears throat> some use of speaking to my steward monitor? But in any case, I have a task for you. All right, it's a little to read. So you got to hunt down some robber bandits. So we'll do that eventually as well. All right, let's talk to Monero the steward. Good day to you, young man. What do you do here? I'm the sort of of uh, sort of this castle. If you bring prisoners straight to me, so it's pretty much a ransom broker as well. All right, let's talk to him again. All right, let's sell these two boys off for fifty. And do you know where I can find the Baron? I'm new to land. Yeah, okay. This is another feature here in Bones of Ragnarok. Well, Mercator, you need a map. You can discover everything yourself. <coughs> Excuse me. You can discover everything yourself, of course. As you approach a location, you will know where it is. However, it is often wise to base your success on that of people before you. I personally have a book, and it tells me the location of everywhere. I need to go within the kingdom of Estimir. There are guides of the outer kingdoms, of course, but I do not have them. I'm a simple man and will stay within my country. In fact, I have an extra copy of the guide that I've been transcribing myself. I have put much work into this, blah, blah, blah. All right, I will take this. Travels in Estimir. Got item. All right, let's go outside and let's see what this uncovers. It covers a few things. We got the city of Ven... Yeah, so basically uncovers the rest of the kingdom uh, of Estimir. The city, anyways. Let's look at inventory. Travels in Estimir. Oh, we have to read it. Okay. Now we have to read that book. All right, we got a few more quests to do. We're going to take on these robber, th uh, robber thugs, hunt down some robbers, and we'll do that in a bit, and we'll continue on with the rest of the story. All right, killed off a few of those uh, robber bandits. Let's see if I got them all. Talk back to Baron Torben. Uh, there's still a few more lowlifes out there to hunt. Let's get to it. Oh, boy. Come on, man. I've been grinding for a long time. All right, we got to find some more of these boys. Got some poachers following me around. Oh, I probably should have sold them. Probably should have sold. Got some deserters following me also as well. I spent I spent a lot of money. I spent a lot of money uh, on weapons already. Jeez. At least ten grand on weapons. Just grinding it out. Let's try to get. Uh... Yeah, this horse is freaking fast. I'll also cost me pretty much my whole whole week's worth of raiding I've been doing. Just cutting them down. Horse makes a big difference. I didn't start off with one and decided, hey, let's get a horse and we should start doing some stuff. Man, these bows are so slow early on. Not used to it. Not used to it. Oh no, ran into a tree. Got out of my way, tree. Takes forever to look back. Alright, should be easy enough. Let's get rid of a few cheap stuff here. A few cheap items, 47, yeah. Okay. Are there any more around here? You know, we got these stupid deserters that are following. Oh man, good, and everyone's following me. Get out of my way. We've got one against 15. My armies, I just got wrecked the, uh, a few plays before. Well, let's go a 
few of these boys. Man, this sword is so slow. Oh my goodness. It's so slow. I suppose my proficiencies aren't up yet, but jeez. Having that fast horse really helps. Yeah, we're just grinding away these thieves so I can get to the next quest. I'm honestly not sure how much of the story I'm going to be playing. It depends. I want to keep it under an hour video. If possible. So I'm going to be doing a few things off screen like quests like this if they take too long. Uh, that are repetitive. I'll just do them off screen, kill a few bandits and all that good stuff. But I thought I had all these bandits and I guess I didn't look at the percentage yet. Yeah, this sword was probably my best to purchase so far. Alright. And we got some observers following me. We'll probably have to get really camp. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is, that's funny. Let me get some intelligence up. We, prisoner management, why not? Alright. Let's see if we can get rid of these guys. They're probably going to catch me. Or not, I'm a little faster than they are. 100% awesome. We'll go back and talk to Baron Torben. Sell some prisoners. And we shall continue with the storyline. Baron Torben. You're going for his kill. Awesome. Nice. Jude of War. Be ready for an enemy. For a strong enemy. Robbers, herders, patrols are sure to have some of their own men out there. Will not take kindly to the death of robber. Good luck, Makator. All right. Oh, I gotta kill robber now. Oh, okay. I want to sell my prisoners first. And, okay. This guy's not leaving his cast, Lizzie. <laughs> got ten poachers for prisoners. We got robber's thugs. Who we have to kill? Defeat robber at his camp. Where is his camp at? Let me see. Robber's hideout. Yeah, there it is. Let's get it. Oh, no. Just, just leave me alone. Uh, <laughs> let's just go to his hideout. And they're following me all the way over here. We'll save beforehand. Well, let's attack the hideout then. I'm not sure how many are here. There's five of them. I do like this scene. I do like this scene. Multiplayer much? Nice. Kill his butt. Let's try to shoot him with some arrows. Man, take, take, an, take an arrow to the, to the chest like, you did nothing to me. Be gone, you vile creature. Be gone. Oh boy, there's a lot of... Holy cow, there's a lot of them around. This bow is also slow. Man, it's... Only thing about I hate starting off with new mods is everything is so slow. Oh boy. What's going on here? No, 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 no. Do not kill me. Do not be gone. I'm receiving a lot of damage. That is not. Look at these arrows. I don't have a shield. My my guy's dead. Oh boy. I don't know. Yeah, this quest. Maybe I should have gotten a few more men. Maybe I should have. How many left? We got two left on my side, five on theirs. We should be able to do it. Let's just charge in. There you go. Got one of those guys. I wonder where, which one's robber. Robber's thugs. I need robber. Robber. Okay, robber's thug. How many are left? Three of them. Oh, there's one down here somewhere. There he is. He done for. Oh, boy, there's one out there. I don't want to get it. Don't want him to shoot me. Zero damage. Good. Oh, yeah, look at this guy. No, 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 no. Why can't I sprint? I want to sprint. Prisno has... Really? Robber has emerged from not where he's hiding to kill you. Okay. Will I die? Where is he? Oh no. That is not good. Look at my health, guys. Oh boy. Yeah, I should have gotten more people.
Can I get him with the with some arrows? He's got a shield. I don't know about this. No, that's not good. Not good. Be gone, Robert. No! No, Robert beat me. <laughs> oh my goodness, do I have to do this again? Do I have to do that again? I'll cut out here. <laughs> it looks like I died. I'm going to get my army back up to health, and we're going to try this mission again. All right, so I got a got a few more troops, leveled up a little bit, and now we're going to try to attempt to take on Robber, Rober, and his hideout, part two, take two, or whatever. But we got some more thugs over here. Unfortunately, uh, I don't think I need to take these guys on right now. I just want to focus on getting that. Oh, I think I should help these village farmers. Sure, why not? Moving to help the village farmers. Why don't I get any positive relation with them, though? That's interesting. Oh, boy. I don't have a shield. That is that is one of the bigger problems right now. That I don't... I'm probably going to have to take... Yeah. Let's just charge in. The archery is still trash. Farmer knocked and nuggets, all right. I should really get a shield. I should really get a shield. This is ridiculous. I can kill these guys easily, but just crossbowmen and bowmen. I, I fought some crossbowmen earlier. I just got wrecked. My armor isn't that good either, but it's decent enough. But I do get some decent stuff. Maybe they have a shield. Oh crap, they don't. I also got a companion that I had to fight for. I had to beat him in a duel to actually get him, which was pretty interesting. Uh, 16... No, I guess we're going to have to do without a shield. But this guy is two-handed anyway, so... Let's upgrade some more of these. Get these militia up. Get these recruits down. Scolge. All right, help the farmers. Let's go on to Morgany. Morgany. Got some two more of these guys. We're going to head to Robert's, Robert's hideout. All right, boys. Actually, no. Uh, I'm at 27%, so I'll wait till at least 90 or so 100%, and I'll be right back. Alright, so I'm at 100%, and here we go. I did buy some mercenary uh, archers in the tavern as well. Mercenary marksmen, they look pretty good. Hopefully I have enough high-end troops. This quest should be that hard. I was just low on health earlier, and that kind of messed me up pretty good. One thing I think uh, would not be bad is having that in the top right corner where Perizno has, the, the small map. I mean, I, I do miss that, but hey, that's what it is. Not every mod can have it. Not every mod has it, and that's fine with me, I suppose. Right, so that took zero damage. Just errors won't really do much to my armor. There we go. Got a, ooh, they're all over the place. We got some behind us. Look at this guy. What's up, bud? I'm actually enjoying this mod so far. I mean, it's a little different than normal normal mods, where the fact that you just play around sandbox, it actually has a story to it, and you actually want to continue it, even though I'm not that far in yet. I've done a lot of uh, tests and all that stuff to, to see how this mod works and all that without recording. And I've gotten decently far before. Wait, what? Didn't even see him. So that, yeah, I didn't even see him. So let's ask our guys to sell this position. And we're going to take out the guys coming over to us. They really have no chance. Rober himself, he's going to face a wrath of my mercenary marksmen. They cost me a pretty penny too. But if you grind early on a little bit, get some money up. Spoilers, it's not really worth it. <laughs> You'll see why. You'll see why. But it's still worth it if you want to do these quests. And But you'll know what I mean. Two enemies remaining. What the heck? Where are they? All the way over there somewhere. All the way in that corner. So let's ask our guys to charge. Uh, where are they? 
that it? Zero. Okay. Where is Mr. Rober himself? He should be down there somewhere. Oh, where's he going? Is he running away? Rober, come back here. There he is. He's gonna take a lot of arrows from my guys. Last time it was just me. I don't think I've lost someone yet. So Rober, he's gonna get it. He's get Rober's getting it. Ro Rober killed by mercenary marksman. Okay, we got more people coming. Okay. All right, hold this position. All right. Not a lot. Even a skeleton's even a skeleton's bleeding. That's. <laughs> That's a good one. I like that. Where's the blood? I don't know. Oh, that's a tough... Oh, man. That's the first mercenary marksman that got taken out, but that's fine. Gather three of the 96 items. Wow. Okay. So these are pretty, pretty decent stuff. We'll drop a few. 237. 210. Just a habit. It's just a habit. Get rid of this crap. I don't want to keep that. 59, 79, and 79, 75. Alright, we're good. We're fine. Alright, so that, that part of the quest. So now, our op defeat Ro Red is camp. Baron Torben scouts have. Yeah. We'll go back to Baron Torben. Got some poachers here. Won't I uh, won't bother them with them right now. Oh, I got some sure. Ooh, you think I could? Ha uh, what are these guys? Veteran crossbowmen. We'll take these guys on. They're pretty good. I faced about 15 of them earlier, and I I died pretty quickly. Oh my goodness! Holy cow balls! That is not good. I don't think I should have taken on these guys without a shield, though. But if I keep moving pretty fast, maybe I can get a few kills. Yeah, these crossbowmen are no joke early on. So that, yeah, we'll get them. Just took out that one horseman. He was he was done for. <laughs> he was. Yeah, he got taken out pretty quickly. How many did we lose, though? Uh, three kill, four wounded. Oof. I'll still take these ten poachers, of course. And we'll go talk to Baron Torben himself. I'm actually thinking I might do part two or part three till we get all the quests done. I'm not sure yet. I don't want to have this video being too long. Uh, about the task he gave me, excellent. Well, the few Northmen I believe in or have you ever beaten wild boar? Eaten wild boar. Blythling's boat in, okay. All right, so now we're gonna do the second quest or the third quest, I believe. We're gonna upgrade myself, get me the strength 15, get that up there and we're gonna save here, of course, just uh, by habit. All right, so we're at uh, 21, 33 troops. A few, a few knocked out and well, but here we go. Nobody should bother us, besides the rogue knight, so... Next part of the quest... Uh, we should... What is this? Rogue knights. One thing I do miss about Parisno as well, you right-click and estimate party strength, so... That might be a nice feature to have. Alright, so we're gonna go to Loganbrook. And we're probably gonna do that quest... As the last quest in this part, so... Very likely I will do part two and part three or whatever, how long this uh, series will take to do all the quests. And let's do this. We're going to go to Loading Brook. Pretty nice scene. I must I must say this is actually a pretty nice scene. I do like the fog effects. And I believe we have, <coughs> excuse me, we have to talk one of the, one of the rangers here. Uh, 
I believe it is the Lord Warden. All right. <sighs> Baron Torben, send me to volunteer any help you need. All right, so, you're, so you are the reinforcements. Okay, you probably noticed that when you arrive, we are in a difficult position. You'll read this through yourself. And yeah, Logan Brook uh, Rangers have joined my party. So now we have a decent army. But guess what? We have to take out some Blythelings. And Blythelings are very interesting creatures from looks of things. Yeah, they're, they're all following me. So 99 of them. I can't do party strength. I cannot do party strength. They're coming. They're coming. No. No. Where? What? Why are they leaving? Patrolling on Logan Brook. These six rangers won't do shit all to these uh, blithelings. Oh, this is. There's a spirit, a scared farmer. Let's recruit this scared farmer, shall we? Please, sir. The spiders just came and took us. Will you take me to safety? Yes, come with me. So a scared, we got a scared farmer. <laughs> <laughs> but we're gonna holy crap <laughs> no no there's 136 of them run, run! <laughs> blightling horror what okay oh my goodness well 51 136. I have a feeling there's really no way to win this. <laughs> I, my troops can feel it too. Here they come. No. <laughs> Help us. So how many are there? 59 on the field right now. They're, they're coming straight at me in a straight line. They're fast, but... Oh my goodness. It's like a horde of... Kill them all! No, just kill them. 60. Wait, what? <laughs> Damage to... That's not a horse! There's 62! There's more of them! No! 68 This is Oh Now we're gonna kill as many as we want can till they kill us. And that's not gonna be easy. Pretty much near impossible. These guys are spiders. That is gonna give me nightmares. These guys have spiders. Look at this mess. Our troops are just killing a lot, but right now they're 110! <laughs> There's 110 of them! <laughs> no! No! There's a hundred twenty! <laughs> There's just getting more and more of them! What is this madness? No! Run away, I say! Run away! We're killing a few, but it's fruitless. Fruitless attempts at this, my bow's crap. Art tree is 77. This is a fruitless. Oh, we got a spear! What is that? That's a freaking. No! Oh no. Oh no. They're still killing a few, but that's uh, not. I think the more we kill, the more appear. Uh oh, what's this? They can't seem to get up here. Hmm. Unfortunately... Unfortunately, there's an endless wave of blightling horrors and all this. Oh, dear lord. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're gonna re we're gonna retreat. 
and we're going to surrender because there's really no way to win this fight. It's it's pretty much impossible. It is impossible. I must there it is. Cuz we have to get captured. We we got just get captured and we're now inside their cave it seems. Why did they kill us? All right, we're going to get out of here somehow. All right. Somewhere in this direction, I'm assuming. There you go. Yep. Here's some. Can you kill these eggs? Probably not. Okay. Let's look at this. Attempt to pick this chest. Lock picking succeeded. Hmm. Leave the area. You must escape. We must. Yeah. Let's go. There you go. All right. So there's one spider over there. Twenty-nine to horse. I guess it's Warbend for you. Man, this is a strong sucker. And my archery's not that good, I suppose. So... There you go. I think there's one more. <laughs> this thing's freaked me out. Ha! Huh. <laughs> yeah, there's one more. And he's got a spear. He's got a spear! Get away from me! Ooh, man, he did a lot of damage. What a... He's like, he's like cavalry and shit. He's like, what is, like Lancers. He's coming in hot. You are brave as well. Let's go back to Loganbrook as soon as possible. You do not want to get captured again. All right, so we are going to leave. And we have three, oh no. So we basically have our companions. Let's go to Loganbrook and talk to... The ranger guy. So after this quest, I'm going to end off this video here. And I will most likely be doing a few more parts of the Bones of Aragonval. Because this is actually a really, really good mod. I really enjoy it. Even though I did work on troops and all a few items in this mod, I did not work on the quests themselves. So, yeah, this one, I, I really like it. Let's go talk to Lord Warden. Mercator, oh boy. Quest cancelled. Search and rescue. You are very lucky to have escaped, but I mourn the loss of those who sent with you. You have proven yourself a, re a poor leader of men. <laughs> yes, sir. It was my fault. Indeed. Yeah. The warden is a fool to banish you. Your entire mission was his idea. Okay. And yeah, join me next time for more Bones of Ragnvall.